taking over the world one nerd at a time. Total Nerd Takeover. Hello, Chris Gray from Total Nerd Takeover Studios, and today I want to talk about keeping your iPhone 6 Plus fully charged. That's right. Now, I found a product that I think will solve my problems. Uh, it's called the iPhone 6 Plus battery case made by Han Chi. It's the Ultra Thin. And when I say Ultra Thin, this is probably one of the, this is the thinnest uh, battery backup case I've ever seen. Now, keep in mind, it only has a 2,000 milliamp hour um, bat, uh, internal battery and that's how they're able to keep it so thin uh, made in China the instruction manual was terrible um, I found it to be uninformative and didn't give me uh, the correct information unless they were talking about the iPhone 6 case because you can also get this in the iPhone 6 case as well um, like I said it has a 2000 milliamp hour battery uh, which gives you roughly I don't know 12 hours of talk time and maybe six more hours of internet browsing give or take the other cool thing about this case is it doesn't add any more length to your iPhone 6 Plus because the iPhone 6 Plus is already uh, a pretty big phone as it is. Okay, so here is the Han Chi iPhone 6 battery case, ultra thin, up close and personal. This is exactly how it came from Amazon. And as we take it and unbox it here a little bit, now keep in mind it may be a little bit dirty. Uh, and rough here, it's got some dirt here and some, it's, it's actually wear and tear, not so much dirt. And uh, it, it took a beating. I've been using it for about three weeks now. And uh, the one thing I got to say, as much as I like this, uh, this case, this battery case, um, it did not hold up too much to uh, transferring um, its paint off of my uh, holster. So the paint does come off. It does wear pretty, pretty easily, but uh, that's okay. I'm not really worried about that so much as I am keeping my phone charged. It has this uh, flip cover, which is kind of, uh, which is really dirty on the inside. I don't know if you can see that in the video. I have the studio lights here making everything really pretty and bright, but uh, there is some, some dirt in here and um, that's one of the drawbacks. So you can get this case with the flip cover or without. Uh, with the flip cover, it's about $42 on Amazon. Without, it's about $40. Uh, the flip case is nice because it gives you an extra protection on the front of the screen, and it also helps to act like a stand like so, and I'll show you in a second. Now, as you've noticed, um, it says iPhone 6. Don't let that fool you. It's a misprint. This is actually for the iPhone 6 Plus. There is an iPhone 6 version. It's a little bit smaller, and it's also a smaller battery capacity. So here's my iPhone 6 Plus, and I always recommend taking a microfiber cloth wiping the back of your, your phone and wiping the inside of the case just in case there's any loose dust or dirt. We don't want to get any scratches. And what I recommend doing is volume rocker in first and it just drops in and you push down and that's it. Now the iPhone 6 Plus is in the case. Okay, like I mentioned before, you can use this front flap as a way to prop the phone up. It's not very sturdy, so I wouldn't rely on it too heavily. You're probably wondering, what is this bump here? It's got a little picture of a lightning bolt on it in a, the shape of a battery. Well, I'm going to show you that is how you plug the phone in to charge it. So, just pop this thing off. You have to be very careful you don't lose it. This is another drawback. Is uh, This thing, you, you know, if you drop it, it's very easily lost. Now, on one end, it's a lightning cable. Now, I call this a jumper. I don't know what the company calls it, but that's what I call it, a jumper. So, we have a lightning, ca uh, lightning connector, male end, and we have four little... Um, connecting points and that we're going to line up on the bottom of the phone as you can see unlike other cases there is no extra bulk here you can get right to your headphone jack your 3.5 millimeter headphone jack the mic the bottom microphone is not covered and neither are the speakers and you can see there's the prongs and here is the lightning cables or the lightning port so you just plug it in and watch the charging magic now we're charging now what about charging the battery case itself well, that's where this hole here, where the jumper came out of. That's where that comes in handy. So you take a standard lightning cable and you plug it in and it will start to charge. Now, if your phone is down under 100%, the, batter, the power will pass through the battery first and charge the phone first. When the phone is up to 100%, it'll then start to charge the battery. 
in the case. Uh, the instruction manual talks about this light right here. Now it's red right now, telling me that it's charging. Uh, it's charging something. It's charging the. I know it's charging the iPhone, but it's telling me it's charging something. I don't know when the case is at full charge until this turns green, and that usually indicates that the phone and the battery pack are charged. The instruction manual says something about a blue light. I've never seen a blue light, so I'm just going to go by what I've learned in the last three weeks. Uh, like I said, lightning cable charges the battery and charges the iPhone. Uh, the only drawback with that is, like I said, data cannot pass through here, only power. So if you want to sync with iTunes and you're not using iCloud, you're actually plugging it with the cable, you actually have to plug it into the phone, which isn't a big deal because all you have to do in that circumstance is unplug this jumper, okay? Plug your, your uh, lightning cable into the iPhone because there's nothing blocking it and make sure you put the jumper back on the case. So thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. Um, I hope the Han Chi Ultra Thin iPhone 6 Plus battery case will solve a problem for you. Um, if you like it, link in the description. Helps to support us here at the studio. And we don't just do videos. We also do podcasts. We do five different shows throughout the nerd universe. Check it out at tnerdt.com. And I'll see you next time for another great video.